Hey everybody! Welcome to a very special Merry Christmas version of my Saturday Sports Cards. And today we've got a couple packages that came in the mail. Both happen to be from Donald Blomdahl. I've got a, I'm guessing what looks like a Christmas card. And a Christmas package. This is a pretty beefy little pack here, so... And it's got some weight to it too, so I'm kind of excited. Looking to see if it shows the weight. It doesn't show the weight, but... A good pound, maybe. <laughs> and maybe just for fun. I don't know. If we have time, we'll open up maybe some packs. Um, I do. This is just an empty box of uh, the Mega Box I have on display. But I have some stands just in case that we find some good stuff we want to display. But let's start out with the Christmas card first. This is addressed to me and my family. So let's very, very carefully snip the edge here. Careful not to go through any cardboard or anything thicker than the envelope. Okay. It says, Make a joyful noise unto the Lord all the earth. Psalm 98.4. Very, very nice. And, oh, oh, very nice. Let's see here. Let's read the card first. Uh, Kevin and Ramona wishing you much joy and happiness as you celebrate the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. Warm warm wishes for a holiday filled with happiness, health, and hope. Merry Christmas, Don and Cindy Blomdahl, 2023. Very, very nice sentiment there, uh, Don. Thank you very much. And I've got a Mickey Mantle. Oh, ooh. And a, okay, did not expect that. A King Rippy Jr. Score 92 card. I can only imagine Donald probably has 14.7 million of these cards in his collection, so he could part with one or two. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you, Donald. The kid. And uh, this is a Mickey Mantle. This is a track, actually. Um, I've read this before, but it's a it's basically a testimony of Mickey Mantle and how he came to know the Lord and uh, found salvation through Jesus Christ. And it's an excellent little story. In fact, here, just... If you want, you can pause that. And then there's the other side, and you can read it. There's the back page. Awesome. Okay, and there's a little, little prayer and some verses at the end there. So anyway, very good story. Uh, thank you, Donald, again, for sending me the one, a copy. And what is this? We have a, um, please join us for their Christmas celebration, December 17th. Probably not going to be able to make it, but uh, the adult choir presents the splendor of heaven and the children's choir <laughs> presents angels say what? <laughs> that, that sounds like it would be a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, if you're in the area, if you're up in the uh, outer Seattle suburbs, you may want to check that out. It's at their church there, Fellowship Baptist Church, which my wife and I have visited. Uh, I've been, I've actually visited a couple times, and uh, good people, good fun, good fellowship. So yeah, that, that should be fun. Thank you, Donald, for that Christmas card. We'll set that there. Now let's see what kind of package is waiting for us here. Let's see, let me just cut the end here. There we go. Uh oh. It's a package within a package. It's a Russian nesting doll package. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. we got a couple hanger boxes with, trust me, more than 59 cards. That thing weighs a ton. Same with this one. Wow. Very cool. What does this say? Reusable envelopes. Open one brown. Brown something after each box. Open one brown. 
Oh, I'm struggling with that word. Reusable envelopes. Open one brown. Uh, well, maybe I'll, I'll figure it out as, as we go. Let's see what... Okay, there's there's two eBay envelopes. Okay, brown. Well, okay. Reusable envelopes. Open one after each box. Okay, so there's two of them here. And I'll open one after each box. We'll see what, that, what that's all about. Okay, let's see. Let's see what's in this box of uh, Heritage 22 Baseball, which... Probably not going to have Heritage Baseball in it, but... Well, it looks like he... Did he retape that side? No, that's the original seal, so we're going to open this side. Yeah, good call. There they are. Oh my goodness. Well, they just keep coming out. There's more. E. Okay. One's kind of caught up in there. Okay. Oh, oh, there's a sleeve. Something slid out of the sleeve, I think. I'm not sure. Um, well, we'll get this one out of the way early. There's Manny Machado. Ugh. <laughs> but tis the season to be jolly. I'll, I won't trash it. Okay, let's see. Let's do one stack at a time here. Okay, let's see what we got. Looks like some vintage uh, Padres here. We got Dave Leeper. This is 89 Fleer. Uh, Lance McCullers. Da Dane Eorg, 86 Tops. Gene Walter. Oh, and we got a Juan Soto on Allen and Ginter, and he is soon to be wearing a Yankees uniform. Okay, we got Blake Snell, Cy Young winner. Good for him. Uh, Scott Kulbaugh. Oh, Las Vegas Stars. Very cool. I know why you sent that one. Now, what year would that be? 1992. Skybox. Okay, I was going to say, we're not no longer called the Stars here. They're the... Well, they went... Then they became the Las Vegas 51s. And then now they're the Las Vegas Aviators. And now that Oakland's moving into town, we don't know what's going to happen to the AAA team. Okay, we got Bruce Hurst. Seth Lugo. Um, e. Guy Rosario. E, e way e, e, I'm not sure exactly how to say that. Fernando Tatis Jr. wearing the uh, City uh, City Connect Nike jersey, crazy colors. Marvell Wynn, 89 tops. Steve Boros, coach, another Dane Diorg. Bip Roberts. Okay, let's flip these around. Okay, we got a Mark Melanson. Oh. You know, I don't know if I remembered him being on the Padres because uh, he was most recently with the D-backs. Did not expect that. Uh, Brian O'Grady. Another Brian O'Grady. Another Cy Young winner, Blake Snow. Powerful pair. There's Cor Cornworth and Tatis Jr. Emilio Pagan. Another Emilio Pagan. We've got Drew Pomerantz. Matt Strom. You might recognize him as uh, he's a fellow YouTube card collector and opener. Uh, Manny Machado, Yu Darvish, another Blake Snell, uh, Diamond Kings, Fernando Tatis Jr., another Manny. Now, notice I'm I'm saying his name. I'm being polite. I'm um, I'm in the Christmas spirit, so we're being nice to Mr. Machado today. I haven't called him Mister. How about that? Uh, Fernando Tatis Jr., another Tatis Jr. I like that. That's like a chrome. That's an optic. Diamond Kings. That is a gorgeous card right there. That's not a regular Diamond King. That's a really flashy one. Uh, Hugh Darvish from Fire. We got an Eric Cosmer. Another Blake Snell. And some more up down, side down cards. So, Okay, we got another Gene Walter. Uh, Adam Frazier. These are from Opening Day. Eric Cosmer. Tatis Jr. Trent Grisham. 
Adam Frazier, Blake Snell, Trent Grisham, Adam Frazier, Tatis Jr., Manny Machado. I'm actually saying it. Uh, Fernando Tatis Jr., another Machado. Eric Hosmer, Yu Darvish, another Hosmer, another Grisham, and oh man, I can't get enough of these. These are really, really nice. These Chrome Diamond Kings of Tatis Jr., another Snell, Tatis Jr., another Snell. And we got uh, Ryan Weathers. Um, I put in for a redemption for a Weathers card. Oh, gosh. A year and a half, maybe two years ago, it seems like, uh, from Panini. Never got anything back. Didn't expect to, but their redemption program is pathetic. Uh, Trevor Rosenthal. Uh, Trent Grisham, Future Stars. Look at that dive. Fully laid out. Nice. Uh, Cronenworth. Hosmer, San Diego Padres team card, another Weathers, and oh, very nice, Artist pal Palette, Blake Snell, I like that matte finish look to it, and a U Darvish, very nice, okay, halfway through that stack, or I should say halfway through that box, finish that stack. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Um, I guess we'll just do it this way. Okay, these are sleeved. We got a Kirby Young, uh, Kirby Yates, sorry. Uh, Trent Grisham from Stadium Club, Manny Machado. Chris Paddock, Blake Snell. These are from Gypsy, uh, Gypsy Queen, Tommy Pham, who was in the World Series with the Diamondbacks. And I'm afraid we're not going to have him again next year. I think he went free agency and probably went elsewhere. Uh, Luis Camposano. Uh, Jerks and Profar. Reese Kinnear, rookie card. I honestly don't know of him. I've never heard that name before. Jorge Mateo. Manny Machado. Another Manny Machado. You Darvish. And yeah, here's your regular. In fact, I wonder if I could do a comparison here. Let me pull up one of the glossy ones to show you the difference. Can you see the difference there? The base versus the, the chrome. And see, that just says Donruss on it. And this one says Optic. So pretty cool. Okay. Okay, Jake Cronenworth, Diamond Kings debut, Yu Darvish, Jorge Mateo, Hassan Kim, Yu Darvish, Manny Machado, Trent Grisham, Trent Grisham, Trent Grisham, Trent Grisham, <laughs> Manny Machado. Okay, I was going to say, that's a different looking Machado, but yeah, another Machado. There's Machado again, and Machado. Oh, and that's Grisham. Chris Paddock. There's Machado. Whoa, where do you go there, Mr. Mike Clevenger? Oh, man, I that guy, I know he came from Cleveland, then he went to the uh, Padres, and then he left. I don't remember where he went to. He was just a fun character. He was just a fun guy to watch pitch. He was very animated. Oh, we got Ha Sung Kim. Another Clevenger. Paddock. Blake Snell. Eric Cosmer. Will Myers on a... He, that could almost pass as a MasterCard credit card. Like, if you go to the store, pull this out of your wallet, and hand it to the cashier, they may actually take it for half a second. That'd be kind of a fun trick to try. Do you take MasterCard? Yes, we do. We'll take that. Um, Jake Cronenworth. Trent Grisham. Will Clark. Oh, did not expect that. A little throwback design. Interesting. With the Giants. Uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. diving in for home, looks like. He's heading to home. I uh, got Demelson, Denelson Lamette, another Grisham, C.J. Abrams, I think he's with uh, the Nationals now, Luis Camposano, another Clevenger, Machado, Cronenworth, Luis Patino, Manny Machado, Manny Machado, Blake Snell, Eric Cosmer. I ought to just start a, a Machado PC. I got enough to do it, right? Just go for it. Uh, Mike Clevenger, 
Luis Camposano, another Clevenger. I mean, his hair kind of speaks volumes about his personality. His personality mimics that of his hairstyler. Crazy. Hassan Kim, Chris Paddock, and a Denilson Lamette. Okay, so that wraps up that box. Very cool. Now, I want to go back to the directions on the envelopes. And what did I do with... Did I toss that down here? Okay, what did I do with that notepad that had the, uh, the directions? Oh, it's back here. Okay. Re reusable envelopes. Open one brown after each box. Okay. I'm just going to go for it. I've opened up one box. So, why do I have Machado there? Oh, because he last one in the box. Okay, so let's just start here and see what this is all about. A resealable envelope. Okay, I see they're reusable, which is good to know. But there's a top-loaded card in here. Oh, it's backwards. Okay. Oh, from here. Well, I tell you what. Is this? If this one's from San Diego, we're gonna do this one first. Yep. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. This one says Diamondback. So I'm gonna stick with the Padre theme at first. So let's do this one. San Diego. It's a pitcher. Okay, I guess this is the right way. Where do you go? Okay, here we go. San Diego pitcher. That looks like a Ryan Weathers picture. Oh my goodness, it's autographed. Look at that. Ryan Weathers. Well, who needs the Panini redemption anyway, right? When you gig it, an original autograph card anyway. So I can just quit waiting for my redemption to ever show up. <laughs> Perfect. I'm glad I shared that story about him and that redemption because uh, I was a little miffed that I didn't get his autograph like I kind of should have. So, very cool. Thank you, Donald, for that. That's going to go right back here on a stand. Very, very cool. All right. So, let's. See. this is a reusable envelope. So, I will hold on to that. It's in good shape. So, that's a D-back. So, can I assume that these are Diamondback cards? I'm just going to make an assumption. I, that's a dangerous thing to do, but I'm going to do it. Uh, well, actually, I see Padres. Might be more Padres. Oh, okay, there's a D-back. I see some D-backs here. This one does not want to let go. I think there's some adhesive down in there, and it's like glued itself. <laughs> I don't want to mess up the card. Ah. Oh, a little, little sticky there. Let's see if it's still sticky. I'd say there's some stickum on that card, don't you think? Either that or I'm an impromptu magician. Okay, that probably could, well, I'll play with that one. But anyway, we got a Josh Reddick for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Okay, we'll set that there. Let's, um, actually, let's do what I know is to be Padres to keep with the Padre theme, and then we'll get on to the D-back. So there's the U Darvish, Juan Soto. Oh, now that looks, that goes back to his Washington days there. That's cool. Uh, Jose Azucar. Jake Arrieta, Josh Bell, Brandon Drury, uh, Juan Soto with the Padres, Jake Cronenworth with the 87 Tops design, Manny Machado, uh, James Steeles. Now, this is these are originals here. Yeah, these are 1988 Tops originals. There's Gary Templeton. Very cool. Eric Nolte, Jimmy Jones, Joey Cora. If I'm not mistaken, I believe he is now a um, third base coach for, I can't remember who, 
but there's an Alex Cora too, I think. So are they, I don't know if there's brothers, they're brothers, but they have the same physique, kind of a tiny frame. But uh, anyway, the Coras are very involved in baseball to this day. Kurt Stillwell, another Kurt Stillwell, and another Kurt Stillwell. Randy Myers, Randy Myers. Phil Clark, let me guess, another Phil Clark coming? Nope, <laughs> I was wrong. Doug Brock Brockhale. I'm not sure how to say that. Greg Kegel. Uh, Gary Sheffield. Very nice. 92 National League. Batting average leader. Okay, we got Tim Scott. Isn't that Congressman? Tim Scott, I think. Um, Kevin Ward. Gary Sheffield. Craig Lefferts. Craig Lefferts. Craig Lefferts. Rich Rodriguez. Um, hey, oh, I thought that was Benito for some reason. Uh, ben Davis, the other Benny. <laughs> oh, okay, I was, I, I honestly didn't notice that that was an acetate card. I'm like, they cut his name off with his leg, but uh, that's because this is an acetate card. Ben Davis, very cool. Clear assets from Classic, 1996. Cool. Okay, there's Ben Davis again as a prospect. Uh, building blocks, Ben Davis. Got a lot of Ben Davis. Got to learn about that guy. Uh, Jay Gaynor for the Wichita something or another's. Jay Gaynor from Wichita. Okay, acquired in San Diego's 24th selection. So he was drafted by the Padres. Okay. And Jay Gaynor again with the High Desert Mavericks. Uh, Glenn Dishman, Kevin Ward, Andy Hawkins, Keith Moreland, Carmela Martinez, Jimmy Jones, Eric Shaw. Yes, it's pronounced Shaw, by the way. John Cruck, Dave Leeper, Tim Flannery, Carmela Martinez, Marvell Wynn. Cover your eyes. It's a Sean Abner from the 91 Fleer set. Uh, Calvin Chiraldi, Eric Shaw. John Crook, Greg Harris, Gary Templeton, Mike Pagliarulo, Bip Roberts, Joey Cora, Gary Templeton, Gerald Clark, Eric Nolte, Chris Brown, Mark Davis, Andy Hawkins, Carmelo Martinez, Keith Moreland, Carmelo again, Andy Hawkins, Gerald Clark, Here's something different. We got a Ray Holbert rookie card from Score 95. Another Ray Holbert. And, ooh, Chuck would like the background on that one. Glenn Dishman, rookie class with the American flag in the back. Very nice looking card. Okay, we got Gabe Alvarez, Ray Holbert. We got Jim Lewis from the Wichita Wranglers, which I now know is an affiliate to, that's the double-A team, I guess, for the Padres. And then another Glenn Dishman, uh, Ben Davis again, and Ben Davis, and Ben Davis. Very cool. All right. So we got three full stacks of Padres and a very, very nice Ryan Weathers autograph. Now, I believe we're moving on to some D-backs here. So let me confirm that by flipping this over and seeing what we got. Okay, so we saw the Josh Reddick. We'll start that at the bottom. We've got a Cole Tucker. Um, actually got to see him play in uh, when he was with the Reno Aces down here in Las Vegas when they played the uh, Aviators last year. He's an Arizona boy, Phoenix born and bred. Yep. What was he after the Pirates? He was with... Uh, Nobody, yeah, just pirate, pirate straight to the D-backs. Okay, oh, and Jordan Lawler, very cool. Bowman Chrome, Mojo card. That one's going to go in a special binder I got. Uh, Cattell Marte, very nice. It's one of those uh, optic cards. I'm going to set the, the players that I've got specific bind, binders for, I'm going to set them back here on the back. Uh, Paul Goldschmidt, fire. Zach Gallen, very nice. My favorite pitcher. Sorry if I keep bumping the camera. I'm reaching around it here, and I 
bumped it. Uh, another Paul Goldschmidt with the Cardinals. Uh, Cattell Marte. Awesome. Not sure if I've got that card or not. Um, Andy Young. Another Zach Gallon. Didn't win the Cy Young, but he was a contender for it this year. Ooh, nice. Corbin Carroll. Prospect Bowman Paper. Look at that. Gosh, he's so young looking. Nice. Corbin Keller. Keller. Corbin Carroll, National League Rookie of the Year. Bryce Jarvis, very nice. Prospect card. Oh, Dalton Varsho. Rookie. Man. I miss him, but at the same time, I really enjoy having Moreno and uh, Guriel. I'm not sure if Guriel is going to return this year, but uh, we definitely have Moreno for, for keeps. Uh, Paven Smith, super nice kid. Got to meet him in, here in Vegas when he came down with the Aces once. Very nice kid. Uh, Cole Calhoun, local uh, Phoenix belt boy as well. Uh, another Paven Smith. Nice to have duplicates of that card there. And uh, oh, Starling Marte. There he is, Gabriel Moreno. Set that one aside. Got there's see, I mentioned Mark Melanson earlier on the Padres. I did not know he was with the Padres. I only know him as a Diamondback. Uh, Joe Mantiply played in the All Star game last year. PJ Higgins. Don't know much about. Him. I did. I did see him play once or twice this last year, but uh, I, he didn't really do much uh, worth talking about. Uh, I don't think I've got that Moreno. Very nice. Uh, Cattell Marte. Another Cole Calhoun. Another opening day Marte. Another Cole Calhoun. Another Cole Calhoun. Another Andy Young. I shouldn't say another. That's the first of that card. Uh, Stephen Crichton. Carson Kelly. Man, I, I do miss him. Um, it's a shame that uh, he had to watch the World Series from home, not in the dugout, unfortunately. Uh, just didn't quite recover from his injuries well enough to make it. Uh, Zach Gallen. Josh Van Meter, Josh Reddick, Josh Rojas, or as they would say on TV, Josh Rojas, uh, Merrill Kelly, uh, is Drupal Cabrera, he's a character, Josh Van Meter, uh, Joaquim Soria, I remember him, uh, another Merrill Kelly, Cattell Marte, uh, another Cattell and a Jordan Lawler. Uh, Paven Smith, very nice. One of my faves. Oh, Fogo Power, Fogo Power de la Pica, Eduardo Escobar. I still have a binder for him. Oh, I forgot to put Paven in that pile. He goes back there. Uh, Luis Gonzalez, nice throwback card there. Cattell and a Varsho. And a Paven. And a Goldie. Oh, and a Mini. We got Andy Young. Mini. Very nice. I'll set that one right there. Uh, Drew Ellis. Jake McCarthy. I have a McCarthy binder. Um, Luis Frias. Seth Beer. I think we just let him go to... Ah, uh, I've forgotten already. Where did he go? Well, anyway, we, we traded him off. Um, Cattell Marte, aficionado. Not sure if I've got that one or not. That's a unique one, but I do like it. Uh, another Cattell Marte, Diamond Kings. A Dalton Varsho, Diamond Kings. Paven Smith. This is one of the cards. Uh, I actually got a couple of these autographed, and I believe Chuck and Aaron each have a copy of that one with his autograph on it. Uh, Paul Goldschmidt. Oh, see, I'm forgetting to put him in the right place again. I've got a beer and a Smith binder, so set those aside. Uh, Cole Calhoun, pink. Cole Calhoun, base. Another Cartel Marte. Uh, Luis Frias, rated rookie. Seth Beer, rated rookie. McCarthy, rated rookie. And an Unsung Heroes, Cartel Marte from Absolute. And that one, I don't, I've never seen that one before, so I'm pretty certain that that's a new card in my collection. So, oh my goodness, all these cards here, Donald. 
go in very specific binders. These go in my Diamondback collection. These go in my Padre collection. But these these cards will go in a very special special place. So thank you so much for that. All right. Let's see what is in this. Let's see. Does it go this way? I guess it goes this way. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Arizona. You can tell. First baseman. It's either Christian Walker or Pavin's the backup. And that's Pavin Smith. Pavin Smith. This is a mosaic, I believe. Is this going to be autographed? If not, oh, it is. Rookie autographs. Oh, this is going to be gorgeous. Oh, I'm going to love this one. Look at that. Pavin Smith auto. Sweet. Oh, that was one gorgeous card right there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Donald, so much for that. Wow. Tell you what, I'm going to get the Weathers and the Smith cards up front. That is... You know what? I, I, I announced earlier I'm going to make this a Saturday sports card show, but I may not. This may be a separate standalone uh, Christmas special to Donald because this was just way above and beyond... Um, well, man, maybe I will make it a, a Saturday sport. Well, whenever you see this is when you see it. That's the way it's going to be. <laughs> no matter what it's titled, you're going to get the content regardless. So, wow, Donald, thank you so, so much. Um, start out with your favorite player, the kid, and ended with one of my all-time favorites playing right now, Pavin Smith, with a plethora of Padres and Diamondback sweetness. This was just awesome. Lots of fun. Um, we actually cracked the half hour mark. I didn't know we were going to go this long, but uh, wow, 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 wow. That was fun. So, Donald, thank you again. Merry Christmas to you and Cynthia. I hope you guys have a wonderful, healthy Christmas holiday. And uh, wow, what can I say? I am not going to open up any more packs. This was just overwhelming. I did not know it was going to be this much. So, guys, I'm going to wrap it up. Thank you so much for watching. Um, stay tuned for another episode coming up soon. I don't know if it'll be a Saturday sports card show or just a, an impromptu unboxing or unpacking. So, uh, whatever it is, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. God bless all of you. Merry Christmas to everybody watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.